Friday, I am going to share my back and biceps workout from this week with you guys. So enjoy the video. All right, so I start every back and biceps workout with a warm up of single arm, straight arm push downs. These are really helpful when you're trying to activate your lats. So as you see, I have my hand right on my lat. It sounds kind of silly, but just try it. It really helps to make sure you really feel where you're supposed to be activating the lats. Keep your arms straight, push down until your hand reaches your hip. I just sped it up on this side. You're gonna do 10 on each side, superset it with the next exercise, and you'll do three sets of these before you go into the full workout. So the second exercise of the warm up is cable or band face pulls. For the gym, again, you can do it on a cable or you can use the resistance bands. You're going to start with your hands facing in. You wanna pull back and you wanna make sure your elbows come back as you squeeze your shoulder blades together and really make sure that comes towards your face. So sometimes people will bring it towards their chest, but you really wanna bring it up and back. So do anywhere between 10 and 15 of those. Remember to do that set three times. Then we'll go into the first super set, which is underhand barbell rows. So grab a bar that is a 30 pound bar that I have there. You grab it underhand make sure you keep your elbows in and squeeze your lats and bring your shoulder blades together as you come back. You're going to do 15 reps of those and then superset it with the next exercise, which is barbell bicep curls. For both of these exercises at the gym, you can just grab a straight pre-weighted bar or a um, easy curl bar. And then I do a staggered stance on these so that I'm not using my back at all. You don't want to be bending back as you lift the bar. You just want to stay nice and straight, keep your core engaged. And you're going to do eight to 10 of these as you can with the weight. And then you're going to go into superset number two. The first exercise is single arm dumbbell rows. So put one knee on the bench. The other leg goes straight out to the side. And keeping that leg straight out helps you keep your back flat. And then you're going to row, bring your elbow back, really squeeze the lats again, and make sure your elbow is staying in towards your side, not sticking out. So you're going to do 12 reps and then switch sides. Repeat for 12 reps on the other side. I just sped this clip up a little bit here. Then we are going to go into a bicep exercise. For the second exercise of the superset, we are doing 21s. So this is a form of a bicep curl. This is great burnout. So you're going to do seven reps from the bottom to the middle. So see how I just pause at the middle there. I don't go all the way up. So you'll do seven reps there. And then we're gonna go seven reps from the middle all the way up to the top. Try not to use momentum too much. So that's why I have a staggered stance again there. It really keeps me from using my back and swinging the way it's up. Then we are gonna do seven reps from the bottom all the way to the top. See, I kind of reset my shoulders there and rolled my shoulders down and back. So you're gonna do seven full reps there. This all adds up to 21 reps, and this is a great way to finish up with biceps. Next, we're going to do pull-ups. So whatever type of pull-up fits where you're at with these right now. So if you can do them unassisted, go ahead and do that. You can do banded pull-ups, you can do the assisted pull-up machine, you can do them with your toes on a box behind you, wherever you're at with these. So do as many reps as possible, then you'll rest for one to two minutes, and then do it two more times, so a total of three sets. Then I magically appear in a different gym. I am going to start this next super set with lat pull-downs, so make sure before you start that you bring your shoulders down and back, retract the scapula, then you're going to pull the bar down to your chest. I like doing a wide grip on these. Squeeze the shoulder blades together, really use those lats, do 10 reps, and then we'll go straight into 10 reps of behind the head lat pull down. So you lean forward into that pad, make sure your head is forward so that when you pull the bar back down behind you, you're not hitting yourself in the head or the neck. This variation has become a back day favorite for me. I always really feel it the next day. So we're gonna do three sets of the super set and then make sure you do some stretching after. All right guys, that was it for today's back and biceps workout. If you wanna see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe and hit the thumbs up button and I will see you in the next video. Bye.